Hi everyone, in this short video, I will show how you can deploy an add-in from Microsoft 365 Admin Center. As you can see, I already logged in to my account and from this menu, click show all and then click on settings and then click on integrated apps. As you can see, I already deployed a few add-ins in my tenants. If I want to deploy a new add-in from this top menu, click on add-ins and then click on deploy add-in. After clicking deploy add-in, the first thing that you will see is information about centralized deployment, which is the name of the service we're going to use to deploy an add-in. For example, you can see add-ins deployed from the store will automatically receive updates. And if you need to learn more about the requirements, you can click here, which I'm going to include the link in the description of this video. After that, click next. Now we have two options. We can either use our, or deploy our custom add-in, or we can go to the store. Right now, I don't have anything, any custom add-ins, so I'm going to choose from the store. Here, we'll see the list of add-ins available for us under suggested for you. If you like, you can look for add-ins that have highest rating in a store, or you can just click name. Or if you're looking for a specific add-in, for example, something for PowerPoint, you can click on PowerPoint and you will see the list of add-ins that are compatible with PowerPoint and you can install that add-in. As an example, I'm going to install anti-phishing add-in for our Outlook. I can either go here or search. And here's the add-in I'm looking for. I'll click, before I click add actually, so you can see the description here, you can, under additional information, you'll see it's compatible for Outlook 2013 or later on Windows, Mac, or on the web. And now I'm gonna click add, I'll agree continue under assigned users i have three options i can choose this for everyone for or for specific users slash group so if you have a security group you can use that group or i can do it you can do just me let's say if you're testing this add-in and then under deployment method you can make that a fix which is the default option for this add-in you can make it available or you can make it optional it's totally up to you for this example i will say fixed and then click deploy here it says it will take up to 12 hours for the add-in to be displayed. Sometimes it takes up to 24 hours. So you need to plan enough time if you're looking for a specific add-in. Then I will click next and then close. So we deployed our add-in. All I need to do is just wait 12 hours or maybe 24 hours. Sometimes it doesn't take that long. Even maybe if in 15 few minutes, you will see the add-in. If I go back to the admin center, if I refresh the page, I should be able to see my add-in that's it's here you can see it's for outlook the status is okay and it's not a test deployment let's say you change your mind and now you want to deploy or remove it from from certain group of people or from everyone in the company all you need to do just go back here and click on the add-in under assigned user you can click on this option and and type the specific users or group or you can make it optional or you can even turn it off and then add-in will get removed basically that's how you can deploy an add-in in office 365 admin center let me know if you have any questions or let me know if you know any other way of deploying an add-in in a comment down below thank you for watching have a good day bye